guys, it's Cece from Head to Heels, and I'm here today to show you my favorite old school shoes. So from back when, I guess uh, my taste was a little more questionable. I had uh, not met my husband yet. Actually, that's true for one of these pairs of shoes. Anyway, let's get to it. Uh, my first pair, and they are so beat up, these pair have got to be like 20 years old. I got them when Payless first opened and they're Fionis. Sling back, horsehair leopard print. I love the print of uh, this leopard. <laughs> this type of leopard print. Um, you can see they're pretty beat off around here. I used to walk a ridiculous like distance to go to work and in high heels. I don't know why. At the time I worked at a bank and I was in my mid 20s and all my parts were working fine and I would walk, let me guess, about nine city blocks in these to and from work. Uh, also where I'm from is like built on a hill so there's a hill that you gotta go down in the morning and up in the afternoon and yeah it was uh, pretty crazy. Anyway, I'm gonna try them on. It's been a long time since I put these on. I just pulled them out of the drawer for the first time in ages. And I just remember these shoes being so comfortable. I always said if I ever had to play baseball in high heels, it would be in these shoes. Oh. Do, do, do. Look at these things. These are nice. I like it. I'm going to break these out this summer. brings us to our next pair of shoes. Now these are a very special pair of shoes. Uh, these are my wedding shoes. Matt and I had a very unique wedding. Uh, we had only known each other a short time before we got married and we were only engaged for about six weeks. So we got engaged and planned a wedding and got married in six weeks, which is crazy, I know. But it was awesome. We did it like potluck style at a park and had a justice of the peace. And his brother sang a song as I walked up the aisle and everybody brought a dish and a barbecue and Oh, it was just a fun day in the park and very, very low stress on my part. My wedding dress was red with white on the bottom, so I had like a white under here, like a white sweetheart neck with like a red sequin overlay and I had a red headpiece and of course red shoes. And heck, I even had red hair, red lips. These I got on the internet. I can't remember if it was eBay or Amazon. Um, Show story is what it, they are called. Uh, they are definitely like a costume shoe and they definitely stretched out super fast. 
just um, they're like a faux suede with a zebra bottom with like a built-in one inch platform and then I had the bottoms painted till death do us part my friend uh, painted these for us is a wedding gift and I love them so much let's try them on They dangle nicely as well. I didn't really get a chance to dangle them on my big day. Too much running around. Mostly I just walked down the aisle in these, took a few pictures in them, and then I had some red flats that I put on. These kept sinking into the ground even with those ground stopper thingies. Ooh, yes, my God. White Russian with vanilla vodka. Mm -hmm. Highly recommended. guys uh, thanks for tuning in again and I hope you enjoyed seeing my wedding shoes and my fuzzy leopard print platforms that I find so fun and playful uh, if you'd like to see more hit the subscribe button down below and uh, you can follow me on reddit Instagram and patreon at head to heels h-e-a-d to heels h-e-e-l-z all one word thank you so hope to see you again soon Bye.